Vivo Communication Technology Co. Limited, commonly referred to simply as Vivo, named after the Esperanto word for life, is a Chinese technology company owned by BBK Electronics that makes smartphones, smartphone accessories, software, and online services. It was founded in 2009 in Dongguan, China. The company develops software for their phones such as the Vivo App Store, iManager included in their proprietary Android-based operating system called FunTouch OS. Vivo joined the ranks of the top 10 smartphone makers in the first quarter of 2015 with a global market share of 2.7%. With research and development centers in Shenzhen and Nanjing, the company employs 1,600 R&D personnel as of January 2016. History Expansion Since the company's founding in 2009, Vivo has expanded to over 100 countries around the world. Vivo began its international expansion in 2014 when it entered the Thai market. The company quickly followed up with launches in the India, Indonesia, Malaysia, Myanmar, the Philippines, Thailand, and Vietnam. On December 2015, Vivo entered the Philippine market with its Y51 model. This phone once called the greatest first phone to release by a company. In 2017 Vivo entered the smartphone market in Russia, Sri Lanka, Taiwan, Hong Kong, Brunei, Macau, Cambodia, Laos, Bangladesh and Nepal. On June 2017, it entered the Pakistan mobile phone market and the Vivo brand is currently experiencing rapid growth in popularity in the country. On the 26th of November 2017, Vivo entered the Nepali market with its Y 53 and Y65 models. Marketing In October 2015, Vivo became the title sponsor of the Indian Premier League under a two-year deal starting in the 2016 season. In July 2017, the deal was extended until 2022. In June 2017, Vivo reached a sponsorship deal with FIFA to become the official smartphone brand of the 2018 and 2022 FIFA World Cups. The company also became a title sponsor of India's Pro Kabaddi. Vivo currently has a sponsorship deal with the U.S. National Basketball Association in China, with Golden State Warriors player Stephen Curry endorsing the brand in China and the Philippines. Vivo has also struck a deal with Marvel Studios, appearing in Captain America Civil War as both Captain America and Iron Man's phones. Topic. Phones Vivo has made numerous phones including several concept phones. Out of them Vivo V series are the flagship models of the company. Topic. V series Topic V9. The Vivo V9 release on March 2018, with dual rear camera setup for Indonesia version with 13 MP plus 2 MP, 16 MP plus 5 MP depth sensor, and the 24 MP AI front camera, 12 MP dual pixel for Vivo V9 6 gigabytes Indonesia. Vivo V9 6GB with Qualcomm Snapdragon 626 with AI engine up to 2.2 GHz octa-core. V10 
V11 The Vivo V11 was released on September 5, 2018, which is the first Vivo smartphone to share a circular halo notch design like the Oppo F9 and R17's water drop notch. It features an under-display fingerprint sensor from the X23 and for the first time, it is integrated with the Jovi Voice Assistant in the Chinese market, particularly BBK Electronics. Topic X series. Topic X One. In 2012, Vivo released the X One. The X1 was also the first Vivo phone to use a hi-fi chip, developed by American semiconductor company Cirrus Logic. Vivo followed this up in 2013 by releasing the world's first 2K resolution screen phone, the X-Play 3s. Other popular phones in the Vivo lineup include the X5 Pro, the X5 Max, and the X-Shot. X20 Topic X21. In 2018, Vivo unveiled the X21 UD, the world's first smartphone with an under-screen fingerprint scanner. It used the Clearid technology developed by Synaptics. Topic X23. The Vivo X23 was officially revealed for the Chinese market featuring an improved under-display fingerprint sensor and the all-new Jovi Assistant developed by Vivo. <laughs> NEX series <laughs> NEX. Vivo unveiled a concept smartphone named Vivo Apex at the Mobile World Congress 2018. The concept phone features a high screen to body ratio, 91.2%, pop-up front camera and two optical fingerprint scanners under its OLED display. They put it into production several months later. The production version was named Vivo NEX. Topic NEX Dual Display Edition. Vivo unveiled the NEX Dual Display Edition, having a second OLED screen and triple rear cameras embodied at the back with a lunar ring instead of a sliding module. 